Okay, well we have the crystal darter. Its behavior is really interesting because it will hide in the sand and then when it, when it senses that there's some prey, it'll kind of leap up and get the prey, which is kind of rare for this kind of fish to do, so. They're very sensitive to water quality, yeah. So people have to be careful, you know, with fertilizers and pesticides and herbicides. Oh, it's, it's an American burring beetle. It's interesting because both parents take care of the young, which is not very common in the insect world. And, and they feed on large carrion, so um, there's not a lot of space for that. And I, I guess also people might find that uh, unappealing to have. <laughs> this one is a plant that okay. I've already put up. And What's the plant? Uh, Facet's loco weed. Somebody named Facet discovered it and loco weed because it, it makes whatever you eat, eat it act erratically. Really? Yes. So is it what, like uh, psychedelic or? <laughs> I've never tried it. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> All right, well, this is the next one. It's the Saint Koi snake tail. It's a dragonfly. It was um, kind of recently discovered in 1989. Well, this um, scientist came upon some uh, larva, and he thought that it looked different from others that he'd seen, so he brought it back in the lab, or brought some of the larva back in the lab and had them grow into dragonflies, and then realized he discovered a new species. So I think that's pretty interesting. Again, that things are still you know, being discovered, even now in Wisconsin, you know, not in the tropics, not in somewhere far away, but you know, right, right where we live. It's a winged maple leaf mussel. Uh -huh. And it's um, interesting because its larvae only live on channel and blue catfish. I hope so that maybe some conservation groups will get the idea that they can, you know, uh, create interest with these kind of creatures too. And I was also told that they're less um, controversial. So maybe people would be drawn in more than, you know, with wolves, I think, oh no, they might, you know, eat our cattle or, or something like that. But these. That guy's not going to eat it. Yeah, right, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs>